I just open up my own company today, actually. And um, okay, well, can I be your first customer then and, and buy some of your time? Sure, you want that? <laughs> How to get an RPA developer job? I called Eric Gillette from Boundless, and he will immediately hire you if you keep watching. Hey, Eric, what is Boundless? Well, Boundaryless uh, we, we focuses on what we call deep expertise. So yes, we do RPA. We also do test automation and 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 analytics. And uh, yeah, we have grown, yeah, you know, like with, with a slightly different angle than than other companies. Like I used to lead uh, business improvement at, at UBS, and I was the head of RPA for a company now called Acero Luxotica. People will know brands like Oakley and Ray Ban. So. Uh, just to 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 identify the company better, and 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 what I always saw is that the big consulting companies that that we worked with, we always spoke to super intelligent people. But then when the workforce entered the building, you you went like, hey, what happens here? And and that applies to the big four names, that applies to like the big French consulting companies, and the big Indian consulting companies, and and I got personally a little bit fed up with that uh, and started working with UiPad MVPs in my role. And then when I started Boundaryless, I, I, I actually made that uh, a proposition. Or right? wouldn't you like to work with the experts right away instead of you basically paying a lot of money to consulting companies where you end up training up their graduates, right? And 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 this has been uh, yeah, very well received. We, we, we are, we are, we are like, you know, we, we, we hit something there that, that resonates with people. That sounds really nice, Eric. From an RPA developer standpoint, which qualifications should I improve at to get a job at your company? Well, we 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 call it deep expertise, right? So we would like people that have a specific expertise in a specific skill set. Um, and, and 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 the big the big topic is always like get noticed, right? There, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of um, channels out there, LinkedIn, YouTube. You're very active. Uh, so we we noticed you uh, at, at some point as well. The um, it, it is it just like UiPath MVP is is for instance one way to stand out, right? To being becoming a UiPath MVP uh, is is one way winning a hackathon or at least participating in a hackathon and and doing well is a great way to stand out. Um, but it's it's just it's also you know, what we're looking for is is sort of a combination of passionate people who are also humble. Like we like like in order to work like in deployments, it's it's great to have be the expert, but we don't don't we don't need divas, right? We want people to get the work done, and it, they want to try new things, they want to experiment, and 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 that can bring something new to the to the profession. Also, like like we we do often we we have projects where people ask. Can this be done? And 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 those are those are great assignments, right? And and and, and luckily most of the time we will manage to figure it out. Uh, but we we want to be sort of on that side of the spectrum. We like yeah we are not in all in all honesty not looking for junior developers at this stage, right? We are offering deep expertise, so we we want to build a team that has that those that, those experts. Interesting. So, what exact qualification should I improve at to get a job? That's a good question, right? And I, I, I like I, I, I would love to see a lot of people bringing up their skills because I think as an industry, like everybody would benefit from from, from that. The um, of course, know the basics. Start with the basics. Do your if you are on the iPad, get your certifications uh, done. Like 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 at least advanced developer um certification but also start looking at okay now what else follow your passion like i i talked to some people who have very very creative ideas uh, and 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 luckily like we 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 see them like going to hackathons and actually trying to make an impact like even on on topics like uh, like carbon dioxide uh, reduction right like like and linking that to rpa um but there are current like there's a few topics that are that are very much in demand uh, that that we see. So process mining is 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 huge. Um, document understanding, document processing, test automation is is coming up, uh, and we know UiPath has has a few tools uh, that there. The, uh, the, the of course the 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 big one 
uh, is, is, is artificial intelligence and, and capabilities there. So, you know, like building your own sort of Python models to get better at that and then integrating that with your iPad, I think has, has a lot of future potential, but also uh, like Studio X and citizen developers is, is a big is a big theme. And and like, for instance, I, I did mention test automation. I did mention process mining, but also people who can coach citizen developers like they're they're in they're in in high demand and, and all these three again process mining test automation and 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 leading coaching mentoring a group of citizen developers i would have like uh, almost immediate roles for people that bring that um and those are definitely skills that that will help you get more out of the out of the capabilities and and and, and learn more and and then again follow your passion as well and follow your ideas and and try to create something that's that's your own so we just hired a lady in india who who basically took a challenge from us like can you build a chatbot that actually works with whatsapp right and and and, and this was nowadays it's it's more common than than when we asked the question a, a little while ago and and she pulled it off and we're like oh this is good you did you did something that 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 we thought is is a great client uh, solution because like a lot of people use certain uh, messaging apps like WhatsApp and if you can interface over your WhatsApp if you if you need a password reset wouldn't that be much greater than trying to figure out what the help desk number is and and, and getting it sorted right um, and it's just one of those those examples but you know I'm, I'm sure p your audience may have their own ideas and their own creativity I, I think there's merit in being a specialist right and of course uh, like some some specialisms fit better together like like rpa coding and test automation somehow fit together uh document understanding and ai fit together process mining is a little bit maybe the odd one out um because it, i think it's a, it's almost a different set of skills in, in in my in my humble opinion um but but being an ha, bringing a an expertise it doesn't always have to be the product expertise it's almost like a competency like if you think about automating processes like document processing there's a few more things than just document understanding there that they come into play there's maybe there's workflow there's human in the loop there's and but there's also um being able with the technical difficulties can we actually process an invoice that's partially in english and partially in chinese which happens a lot in asia right and 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 being able to find solutions for 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 those type of problems or what if we have an image that's embedded in a document, but the image doesn't have a standard format. Those, what can we actually recognize what that image is? So I, sorry to go a little bit more deeper, but I think the it is good to stand out and 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 be strong in an in a, in an area, and, and whether that's a specific technical applica technical application application or a, a certain cluster. Yeah, like I'm, I'm, I guess I don't want to be too prescriptive, right? But it's it's being able to, yeah, you know, to to deal with with challenges like I like I illustrated on document understanding. What Eric is telling here is very very important. So rewind the video if you missed it. Specialize in one of the various RPA disciplines, and you will have an easy time to find a job. And the best part is that they are all free resources online, for example, this YouTube channel, but also all the great RPA academies at the various RPA tools. Do you want to commit and specialize in something in the coming? Let me know here in the comments what you will prefer to specialize in. I'll try to do a lot of document processing videos. Do you want to join me? Let me know. And now for the fun part, because this interview turned out to be something that I haven't expected. Keep watching. Thanks for, for joining this one, Eric. And uh, there's definitely a lot of uh, advice that I can use myself. I just open up my own company uh, today, actually. And um, Okay. Well, can I be your first customer then and, and buy some of your time? Sure. You want that? <laughs> That's, you know, I would I would love that. I, I, I You're obviously... You're a specialist. You're an MVP, uh, and and also as a fellow entrepreneur, I think uh, like I would love to support uh, like yeah the, this this big step you're taking. Yeah, that's right. I opened my company 14 days ago, and Eric just booked me for freelance hours. That is very awesome and a great start for my company. 
If you haven't heard about how I plan to start my RPA company, you can watch this video that will explain everything, even how much money I earn.